Hey everyone, so today I'm gonna teach you how to draw Puppy from the animation trolls. If you guys are new to this channel, be sure to like, subscribe and comment below for any requests or any comments. So we're gonna start with drawing the hair in front of her face. So we're gonna do a line that is quite long, a curved line as such and return back and then we're gonna do from that line we're gonna create a similar line just one stroke and that's it beyond that first hair hair piece that we have in front at this point we're gonna create the edge of the hair like so and then on this on the right side of her face we're gonna draw one bunch of hair strand like that and return and next I wanna draw the lower half of her face so we're gonna draw a half circle like that let me try that again because I'm not satisfied so we're gonna draw a half circle again mm. something's wrong with my pen today gonna draw a half circle okay no I think you let me try that again there we go so now we have the half circle for half of the face now we're gonna do the left ear but before that I'm gonna add another line here for before I start drawing the ears so from that corner I'm gonna draw a circular circle elongated maybe an ellipse like that and then for the inside of the ears we're gonna draw something like that and then for the right ear we're gonna continue to copy that on the right side like that and there we have it and there we have the ears so now I'm gonna draw the flowers uh, where puppy have three of them on her hair so we're gonna draw a flower with four petals like that and then some leaves in between of those petals like this and then I'm gonna replicate that flower but the flower on two of the flowers were would have three petals so we're gonna draw three petals and a leaf between them of each petals and then the last flower on the right we're gonna draw three petals and with leaf in between them and then we're gonna draw a line to connect those flowers two lines actually and that will become the headband up till the ear section so there we have it the headband is done and moving on to the Hair above the head 
I'm gonna draw something like a half circle as we have here um, we're gonna draw her hair tied up and So we're gonna draw a half circle above the headband as like that and another half circle like that and then we draw the hair hairband in half circle and then we're gonna draw the hair above that hairband So we, what we're gonna do is we're gonna do a line extending upwards in a circular motion. So we're gonna do draw something like that and that, and that. okay? And we repeat that again for a few strands and to the opposite direction to the right. I'm gonna repeat the same thing you don't have to be consistent about the size we just make it random and we're done in between of the hair we can add a few lines um, a few long lines and medium ones and maybe some short ones Okay, so in be inside everywhere where you can find the hair, you can just add some more lines as such. And we're done with the hair. So now I'm gonna do the details of her face. So what we're gonna do first is Let's try to do the eyes. So the eyes, I'm gonna draw something like a circle. Let me try that again. Like that. And the other eye behind the hair. inside of the eye we're gonna draw a smaller circle and then another circle for the shine and the black part of the eye and color that repeat that for the left eye and you will have the basic eye shape On top of the eye, we're gonna draw a thicker line like that. Don't forget the left eye, and then we're gonna draw three lines above this right, this right eye, where you have the eye lashes like that, and then you're gonna draw. A line above this this right eye like that and then you're gonna draw the eyebrow we're gonna draw it straight on the bottom and curve on the top part so there we have it we're done with the eye next is the nose so the nose I'm going to draw I'm going to start to draw the bottom part of the nose so we're gonna have we're gonna do tree curve the biggest one in the middle and the smaller one at the sides and then on top I'm gonna just connect them in a circular line like that and we're done so for the mouth 
first I'm gonna do a a small line a curved small line at this both sides of the face like that and then we take the middle part of that line that small line and try to connect it with a curved long line okay and then for the bottom part of the mouth we're gonna do another long line curve more curve this time downwards like that and then I'm gonna add some details to the nose I mean the teeth so we're gonna make semicircles for the teeth it's always wise to begin at the middle part of the teeth so I'm gonna do that like that that's three on both sides let's do three on both sides like that and some more on the bottom part and draw a small line here and another here that's where the tongue is so we're gonna fill up the space that's not the tongue inside the mouth like that and that's it so I'm gonna add some freckles to the cheek of puppy but I'm gonna add one line on top of his her cheek I'm sorry her cheek like this and on the other side and maybe three freckles like that so we're done with the head next is I'm gonna continue with the 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 dress I'm gonna do a a short line underneath the chin and turn back up like that and a small oval shaped button and then a line going up like that and then we're gonna draw the hands we're gonna start with the right hand so I'm gonna draw a line to the right and turn it up for the thumb and go down back and for the other fingers I'm gonna just try to repeat the thumb shape but on a different angle like that and then like this and the third figure and then I'm gonna do another line below the first long line of the hands like that and you just try to connect those the finger with the her arms and I'm gonna draw a circle for the dress so we're done with the right arms and I'm I'm going to draw the shirt where I'm a small line and a longer line downwards and from that curve detail that we have at the neck earlier on I'm gonna draw a line downwards like that and from this end of the line to the other end we're gonna try to connect that with a we don't have to necessarily do a straight line we can do something curve curve line like that okay 
and then I think we're gonna draw the left arms now I'm gonna try to repeat the right arms with a straight line straight horizontal line to the left like that and I'm gonna draw the wrist and then yep the thumb and we're gonna draw it like this going down replicate that and the last finger and there we go Lastly, I'm gonna draw the legs. So from the middle, from the left part of the skirt, you're gonna draw a line from the middle, like that. And then to the left, you're gonna draw one line going downwards, like that. And turn it up going upwards again and then like that give her some toes in a curve draw line and another small line there and for the other foot we're gonna do something similar like that and there and the toes and that's it just at the corner left of the skirt you can add another line below like that and I'm gonna draw a pattern or pattern on her dress a semicircle another semicircle another one and another one and then I'm gonna draw a teardrop shape upwards like that another one and the other one and a small one in a horizontal direction like that and there you have it and you finish with the drawings and that's it for our tutorial today and i hope you guys find it helpful and enjoy my tutorial and hope to see you guys soon oh before that Make sure you like and subscribe onto my channel for the future videos and probably comment down below for any requests or suggestions. Um, that's all for now. See you guys soon. Bye!